on board your board. Let's get this over with. <laughs> well, look who's here. New recruits. Well, <laughs> let's fuck some shit up. Wait, what? As you can tell, we were very surprised too. So, my son has another quirk. Yes, yes he does. In which, when he gets too worked up or angry, he turns into a, a woman. Correct? Um, do you really expect me to believe that? Mom, trust me, it was weird for me too, but it's the truth. Really? You really think? It's like, Mom, please don't make me upset. But, you know what? No, that, that's the whole way you're going out there. As soon as Izuku starts flaring up, it's Inko looking at Izuku's clothes, just terror. At least his pants and his shirt is. On one hand, there's a head of jealousy. On the other hand, it's worriedness. Because that means his whole wardrobe is going to have to be adapted. Just in case he gets upset. If it's not, every time he gets a mad, a little bit pissed, that means he is going to rip out of everything. And since he never knows when it's going to happen, they had to take measurements. Man, I did try to sneak in to see what was going on, but no. Not worth it. So yeah, you can only imagine, like... Uh, you are giving me confusing feelings. No, I'm I'm a complete woman right now. Really? So you have a yes... And you, your friend is gone. Yes, he's. Do you want me to show you? Yes, please. <laughs> Manetta just getting curb stomped by every other girl that shows up. Even the teachers in classroom B. So yeah, everyone's pissed. But Izuku, he just. Trying to keep his cool just so transforming doesn't happen nearly as often. So, the guy who has to be the one of the nicest people has to try even harder not to get upset. So, yeah, you can say his life has changed quite a bit. But now, it is time for, oh god, that's the USJ, isn't it? Oh damn, that's that, that then we doesn't see a chance, does it? <clears throat> Either way, let's just begin. Upon everyone getting on the bus, it's already weird, considering Izuku is the guy, but everyone's just watching Mineta, Kamenari, and Sero, as well as the exploding angry Pomeranian Bakugo because he is very nervous around Izuku more than ever. At first he hated Izuku for lying about not having a quirk for so long but now he's nervous considering that not only is he more than strong enough to beat the crap out of me he can turn into a woman beat the shit out of me again and maybe <laughs> Question whether I want him to do it. So yeah. Bago's going through it too. But at the very least, all he had to do is make sure Mineta, Kominari, and Sero don't try anything. Especially Mineta. 
But soon as people let their guards down, it's right when they arrive. And 13 has been told about what happened. <sighs> I I don't know really how to to help with this besides just give you moral support and maybe some advice. Please don't don't make this weird. Manetta wanna be a, a perv just takes off two sticky balls from his hand and tries to throw them at Izuku. But luckily, the girls shield him while Bakugo ends up blowing him up. He only stops himself and says, Next time, don't miss. Fair point. That, that's fair. Upon them getting separated, the villains are already started attacking. Aizawa is getting bodied by the Nomu. It's uh, not looking too good. You do the same thing when it comes to the whole getting away from the villains from the shipwreck zone. The only thing is, Mineta is still trying to cup a feel. Izuku being more and more pissed, but calming himself down. It's when he, he sees Aizawa beaten, he sees Sue getting nearly disintegrated, that he loses it. He grabs Shigaraki's hands, breaks them, and starts... Yeah. You can say body slamming him over and over and over again. But then No Moose tries to stop him. He grabs No by his neck and rips off his head in pure anger. It's fucking awesome. But also horrific when you consider how I wish I, wish I had visuals. But still, you can just imagine the No Moose head being ripped clean off with Shigaraki being bloodied and beaten up to high hell. Kurigi? Yeah, he has no choice but to, to leave with Shigaraki. Leave the other villains, forget that shit. Well, Izuku, still pissed, goes after the other villains, and it is brutal as hell. When all my gets there, he sees... Izuku stepping on Mineta, while Mineta, with a perverted look on his face, he says, please, don't stop. And Izuku, hating the fact that he's enjoying this, but enjoying the fact that, hell, this is uh, relieving stress, continues! Luckily, he, nothing bursts out of nothing from his hero. Costume, or else there will be a whole mess of nosebleeds by then. <laughs> yes, it takes a, a minute for all my to actually be able to calm him down, but ultimately, at the end, the, and when it comes to the interviews, they. They are shocked when they see Zuku transform back into a girl when they start bad mouthing UA, but him coming down is like the fuck is your quirk? None of your fucking business. Him just breaking the camera and walking away. It was live, so people already know that face and know that body. So that's that's very terrifying. But when it comes to the next day, Aizawa, he's still in the full body cast. He does tell about the sports festival. But at the end of the class, everyone's talking about the whole. Well, they've been talking about the whole Yuzuku being able to turn into a girl thing. Oraka, she's like. Why does it feel like someone's playing a prank on us? Why does it feel like we're being... Why does it feel like someone's messing with our lives? Mina's... Oh, if anything, I like his hair. You don't want to say that because it's pink. 
Is that so wrong? No. But, seriously, his measurements. Yeah, it, it's weird. He, uh, He's bigger than all of us. Yeah! Wait, but... Why, why does that matter? It's a matter of pride, damn it. But it's not like he wants to be a girl. It just happened. It's Bakugo's fault. You're right. He should be punished for this. He already was. No, you you saw the blood coming from his nose. He he was enjoying what he saw. Is they're going back and forth. Momo, she's trying to be the voice of reason, but no one's hearing the damn thing. Jiro is hella pissed. <laughs> Just what the hell is this? Is someone just having fun with my character design? Is someone just trying to be an asshole? Well, I don't know. Maybe. But they all go silent as soon as they see a female Izuku. And them knowing that this one is hella quit to anger and quit to beat the shit out of whoever pisses her off. They. Hey, hey, how, how you doing? Y'all talking shit about me. What? No, no. Don't. Don't bullshit me. As everyone just goes into the locker room, they don't want to bring Izuku considering that, yeah, they don't know when he's going to change back. But he says, believe me, I'm plenty angry. Let's just get this over with. Mineta, him just clinging to hope. Let's see. I brought my equipment. What about you guys? Just looking at Cero and Kaminari. Are you sure this is a good idea? As Kaminari, he takes out a drill. Cero? He, he <laughs> just, uh, he said he bought tape. He bought the tape. Meadows. Okay. Let's do this. As he has one of those snake cameras which you can control and see through whatever angle it will allow as soon as the hole has been drilled the, the place of which it needs to be has been marked and Moneta goes in to see the beautiful heavenly forbidden Oh, what the hell? You know he's just peeping on whoever is there. But knowing Izuku, his measurements, that is pretty much making him a prime target. As soon as he actually gets a glimpse, he passes out due to near blood loss. Kaminari and Sarah are fighting each other for whoever gets to see next. As the wall bursts down, it is destroyed, obliterated, as Izuku is staring down at them, not wearing anything. Everyone else just down. They are down for the count. Even, yeah. Even Kirishima, upon looking, just can't can't handle it. Now, whose idea was this? Hello. Yeah, come on, already, sir. Just just can't stop looking. Tell you what, you got three seconds to choose, or else I kill all of you. Just, just pointing at Mineta, just, just him, 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 he did it. This is all his idea. We were just young, innocent teenagers. 
he uh, he threatened us. He convinced us somehow. We don't know how, but he he is the perpetrator here. He he's he's the one that brought the camera. What camera? Huh? Well, also the people. I didn't see no camera. Oops. Which, upon getting a good look, seeing. Oh. In that case, Sarah, Kaminari, I'm gonna need your help. What? What? I'm gonna teach you a lesson when it comes to respecting boundaries. As he just looks at them with an evil expression and smiles. Why do we feel scared? In which, Manea, he wakes up. And as soon as he heads home to review the work he's done. Instead of a video or in some pictures of Izuku, as well as some other girls, which really was just icing on the cake, he got a glimpse at Saro and Kaminari. And, uh, not so nice ways, you could say. But what really sent him over was when he saw himself in bondage positions. He is horrified, and the scream is heard throughout his household. His parents bursting through the door, seeing if he's alright. Him too horrified to have too much, if any time, to close what he was viewing. The looks on his parents' faces are that of pure shock and what the hell? I did not know you were into that. So, he has no time at all to explain himself. They are already jumping to conclusions. <laughs> this is me. I was unconscious. Look, we we we. <clears throat> we know that you may be curious and open to experimenting, and it's just <sighs> we love you no matter what. Just uh, we don't need to know all your hobbies, but um, damn, we we would have never thought you were into that. You gotta listen to me. It is not what you think. It's fine. It's fine. Like, who did this? Who did this? Him looking to the heavens and uttering, Why do you hate me? Is, am I just a joke to you? Yes. Yes, you are. As Izuku, he's just imagining the amount of surprise on Manea's face, wishing he could see it for himself. But him changing back into a guy, he feels all too bad about it. Nah. But, yeah, he has training to do. For UA Sports Festival, doesn't he? Yeah. Two weeks. But something feels off to him. Something feels like it's missing. Though, yeah, he did end up with this weird power he didn't know he even had. It's almost like 
he's missing somebody. So, Inko sensing this. So, what's wrong? Um, I don't know, but for some reason, uh, uh I, I think I'm gonna go, uh, go to, I don't know. Do, do you need anything? No, it's just. I always wanted a horse. 